I'm going now to start explanation. So, of course, you can unmute yourself whenever you want. Just try it now. Test that you are able to unmute yourself, all of you. You yes. are all able, right? Yes. Yes. So I didn't. I didn't mute any one of you. So whenever you want to participate or to ask anything, just unmute yourself. Okay. Okay. Oh, now you can mute yourself and listen very well to the lecture. Okay. So as I told you, I'm going first to uh, revise for you what's the meaning of line, array, a segment. At the end of the lecture, maybe today or next time, I'm going to explain for you how do we construct or how do we draw. I'm going to teach you the steps of drawing uh, parallel lines and the step of drawing perpendicular lines, okay? So first thing we are going to do is to remember together what's the meaning of line, uh, ray, and segment. Okay, then we are going to tell what are the parallel intersecting and perpendicular lines. Then I'm going to teach you how to construct perpendicular lines. Then how do you draw parallel lines? So first of all, let us remember together what's the meaning of a line, array, and a segment. The first thing was to be discovered, as I told you before, is the point. So what's the first thing to be discovered? I didn't hear you. Point. A point. Very good. So the first thing to the be point. was the point. So the point, it's an exact location. It has no length or width, of course, because it's only a point. It doesn't have a length. And it has a name, and this name is uh, written as a capital letter. So we say a point. A, we say a point B, we say a point C, okay? So all of these letters, must mute yourself. So a point C. So all the points are represented by a letter, a capital letter like this. So you can name a point whatever you want. This is X point, X. So all of these are points and they represent an exact location in space. It has no length or width. Now, the group of points that are placed beside each other like this, did you see that they are placed beside each other in a straight way? Those points, when they are beside each other like this, they form a, what do they form together if I join them? Line. A line. So a line. After, very a good. Line. So now we're going to talk about a line. And a line, as you can see, it's a collection of points. Do you still remember? A line, it's a collection of points going on and on infinitely in both directions. So you can add point as much as you want, okay? So these are the points. Whenever you join them and they form a straight line, just a second, when they form a straight line like this, you can add points to the right or you can add points to the left. So you can extend the line as much as you want infinitely in both directions. Ali, Habibi, Ali. Ali, Eda, just stop, stop moving. Yes, focus, okay? Yeah, so this line, it's a collection of points. So it's a group of points that are straight beside each other and they go to the, in the opposite direction as much as you want, you, you can extend them. And it has no end point. It doesn't have an end point because you can extend it as much as you, as you want. It could be vertically, as you can see, it could be horizontally, and it can be obliquely. So this is a line, and this is a line. This is a line. It can go in any direction you want. It is identified because it has arrows at the end. So every line, 
whenever it has an arrows like this in both sides, then this is a line. Line. Very good. Why do we put an arrow just to indicate that I can extend from this side? So this is a line. Now, how do I name a line? We use two letters, A and B. Okay, C, D. Can you see them? E, F, all of these are points, okay? Now, how do I name the line? I say A, B and I put it inside parenthesis okay so suppose that this is a line ef we say that this is the line ef and we put it inside parenthesis is it clear till now yes so there yeah. are two ways in order to know that this is a line it's either if i have an arrows at both sides or if it is found in a parenthesis Okay, so if I tell you, for example, x, y, like this, and I put here like this, you tell me this is a line because I have here parentheses on both sides. Also, this is a line because what do I have here? What do I have here? <coughs> X, Y. Hello. Walla. What do I have here? La, wadahim kun am tismaouni. How do I know that this is a line? What do I have? From the arrow. Because we have two arrows. You can make it bigger. La, mish, we can make it bigger because we have two arrows at both sides. Then this is a line. This is an end point. Let us continue. So after the line, what do we have? We have something called line segment or a segment. What's the meaning of a segment? It's a part of a line, but it has two end points. What does it have? Two end points. Two end points means it has a beginning and it has an end. This here, look at this figure. What's the beginning of the line? It's What's the beginning of the line? End point. End point. Where does where does the line start? Uh, from A. At A. A. Where does the line start? A. A. Where does it end? D. 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 So it starts at A and it ends at D. So it has a beginning and it has an end. So it is a segment. How do you know usually that this is a segment? Two things indicate that this is a segment. The first thing is when I put like this, a closed bracket, a closed door, did you see here? This indicates that this is a segment because it has a beginning E and an end F, or I have the line and here I have an end point. Okay, so this is a segment. Also, this is a segment. It can be like this vertically this is a segment okay also this is a segment it can be oblique like this this is a segment it has a beginning and it has an end okay is it clear yes great yes, yes. let us go for the third type who can tell me what's the third one array array very good so this is array. Did you see the array? What's the meaning of array? Array, it's also a part of a line, but it has only one end point. So it's for example, starts at A, but it never ends because at the, at, at the second end point, we have an arrow. Arrow means it continues 
in, in this direction as much as you want, okay? So it stops on one end and keeps going on the other. Say it, please. It stops on one end and keeps going on the other. Say it. Stop it on the one end and keeps going on the other. Okay, is it clear, guys? Now, how yes. do I need this way here? It starts with A. So I'm going to write A and I'm going to close on A. Why did I close on A? Because it starts on A. And here I'm going to put C, but I'm going to put it open on C. Why it's open? Because I can extend it on C. Is it clear? Yes. Great. So let us summarize what did we say? Mute yourself, guys. Eltaf and Marie. So let us summarize what did we say. So here we have <clears throat> Yeah. If I put like this <clears throat> Sorry. If I put like this What's this? Segment. Very good. It's a segment because it has two points. How do I name this segment? Yeah. We put the EF and we put it inside a closed bracket. Okay. If I have this. <laughs> This is a ray. It's closed at A and it's open on B. On B. If I have this line, a line. This is a line. Excellent. This is a line. Miss, you can answer and mute yourself directly. Eltaf, please mute yourself. All of you mute yourself. You can answer, then mute yourself directly. So this is X, Y, line X, Y. And you put it inside a parenthesis like this. This is very easy, right? Yes. Yeah. Let us continue now. I prepared an exercise for you. Okay. Yalla, Eltaf, you can start. Eltaf? Yes. Yeah, number one. What's number one? Line. It's a line. Very good. It's a line and its name is small a, a. like this. Yeah. Marie. Yes. Number two. What's this? Marie, number two. Do you know what's number two, Marie? Marie? Segments. Number two, number two. Yes. What's number two? What's this? Ah. Uh, Ray. No, you yeah, miss. It's not a Ray. Hi, the Ray, yeah, Marie. Miss? Hi, Dare. Miss, can I say it? Yes, me and... Lana. Yalla, Lana, say it. 
It's a point. It's very good, Yalana. It's a point, A. This is a point. Point, A. Very good. Amir? Yes. Yala, Three yeah, Amir. Three is what? Segment. Very good. What's the name of Three. this segment, yeah, Amir? AD. Very good. It's AD. And what do I put around AD? <coughs> Close. Close. Bravo, yeah, Amir. Closed brackets. Excellent. Yeah. Now I'm going to choose um, Ali Fawaz. Yes. Hi, Ali. Hi. Yeah, number four. That is a ray. Yes, it's a ray. Very good. This is a ray. Now, what's the name of this ray, Ali? AC. Very AC. good. AC, it's array. Excellent. It's closed on. It's closed on what? It's closed on A. Very and good. It's open on C. Excellent, Yali. So it's closed. Let me just write it. It's closed on A. And it's open on C. Very good. Hala Badi Rushway Badi Noor. Why not Noor? Hi. Hi, Noor. Kifik. Niha. Yala, happy. In number five, what do you see in number five? Um, Line. Line, are you sure? Honey, I have two parts, ya Noor. I have this alone, this is the whole. Ray. Two rays, excellent, ya Noor. I have two rays. One horizontal, one vertical. I thought it was all one. That's right. That's why I did this trick. So this is uh, two rays like this. What's the name of the first ray? A. AC, very good. The first one is AC. It's closed on A and it's open on C. What's the name of the second one? AB. Bravo, Yanwar. It's AB. It's closed on A and it's open on B. Very good. So, I only two rays. They are intersecting من قلن تو intersecting ways هلا بعد شوي حنعمل explanation اكتر عنه is it clear till now yes yeah. great yes yeah. one more exercise I'm going to pick ميرا yes ma يلا يا ميرا and this exercise, you need to tell me if it's a point, a line segment, a line, or ray. I did the first one for you, which is a line, a T. Now, what do you think about number one? What's number one? It's a line segment. It's a segment. Very good. And what's the name of this segment? CD. Excellent. It's closed, right? Yes. It's a closed segment. Very good. Yeah. Hala bad Hsena Saile. Hsen. Miss, this is the worksheet. No. Hsena Saile. The what? Yes. Yalla Rawad. And number two. Yes. What's this? In number two. It is a. Uh, is it a point? Is it a segment? Is it a line or array? Array. Bravo, Yalla This is array. What's the name of this ray? Y, Z, y, X. Or X, Y. Very good. Hala, the question is, this is X, Y. But is it open on X or closed on X? 
It is open on X. Just look at the figure very well. It's closed at X. Oh. Because this is an endpoint. Okay. What about Y? Yes. It's open on Y because you have here an arrow. Did you see the arrow on Y? Means yes. it's open on Y. Okay, the what? Yes. Thank you, Habibi. Yeah, la jude. Yes. Yeah, the number three. Okay. It's a ray. It's a ray. Very good. It's also a ray. What's the name of this ray? You are. You are. Excellent. Is it closed on Q? Yes. Is it open on R? Yes. No. Very. It's open on R because it's we have an arrow. Yes. Thank you, Jude. Hamad Hamoud. Hamad Hamoud. Hamad Hamoud. محمد حمود you didn't answer me معناتها I can't يعني اللي ما بيجاوبني ما بحط له attendance اوكي اللي بسأله وما بيجاوبني معناتها attendance zero بنكمل كريم كردي جاي دورك يا حسن yes كريم كردي number four what do you think this figure is in number four Point. It's a point. Bravo, ya Karim. What's the name of this point? What's the name of the point, ya Karim? L. Bravo, Habibi. Perfect. Ya la hala abadi. Ali Hamoud. Ali. Yes. What do you what do you see in number five? Number five is segment. Bravo. It's a segment. Just a second. This is a segment. N O. Is it closed on N? No. Kif no ma. This is an end point. Ambala. Is it closed on O? Yes. Yes. So it's closed at N and O. Very good, Yali. Is this clear till now? Yeah. Yes. Let us continue. Yes. We still have exercises for the rest. Badan the Hassan Majawab. Badan the Nancy. Badan the Amalu Alin. Yes, Jude. I watched the video. Very good. Did anyone uh, watch the video? Yes. Good. Yes. The video. The video is important. Hala اليوم I بس يكون هيك عندكم وقت. Try to watch the video before tomorrow. Okay. This week you don't have a worksheet. Yes, I watched it. Good. Uh, this week you okay, don't have I'm a worksheet, so now. please try to watch the video because. I did it and it's very nice and I explained everything so you watch it one more time please okay okay yeah now let us continue so now I'm going to start by those exercises okay yalla ya Hassan it's your turn Hassan can you see the figure yeah yalla ya Hassan from the figure I want you to give me a name of a line. A line is A B. Bravo, ya Ali. Bravo, ya Hasmin Ali. Bravo, ya Hassan. It's a line A D. So I put it like this. This is a line A D. Very good, ya Hassan. Um, Nancy. Nancy. Nancy, hello. Yes. Yalla, Nancy. Can you give me a name of another line? It is, um, a line. A name of another a line. line. 
DF. Nine, yeah, miss. DF. Bravo. Bravo, Nancy. Excellent. So, Hassan Alna A, D, and Nancy Alitilna D, F. Is there any other lines? Yes. Yes. What is it? C, F. Bravo, yeah, miss. Excellent. Also, C, F. Come in, Anna. C, F. Bravo. Perfect. Yeah. Now I want. Min baad ma amel dor bil ma. Marie, Marie. Yes. Yalla ya Marie. Can you give me a name of a ray? B E. La B E. It's not a ray. La. It's closed on both ways. But the ray. Can you see a ray? C F E. F. E F works out, yeah, Miss. Bravo. So array E F. Because it's closed on E. This is an end point, and it's open on F because we have an arrow. Bravo, yeah, Miss. Hala, Amal. Yes. Amal, can you give me a segment? Yes. A segment, huh? I I didn't hear you. A and C. Bravo, yeah, Miss. A C. It's a segment because it's closed on A and closed on C. Alin. Yes. Alin, do we have another segment here? Yes. What's the name of this segment, yeah, Alin? B E. Bravo, Habibti. Excellent. So this is B E. Perfect. Now, Miss, there's one more array. It's E D. E D. Very good. And now one more array. It's E D. Akin, we have a lot. It's E D. Very good. B C. La B C. It's all. It's my day. My arrows here. Miss, is this question? Is this is clear? Yes, it's clear. Yeah, now let us start with the second one. Also, I have another drawing and I need to pick a line array and a segment. Now we are picking them all, but Henry, they need only one line, one ray, one segment. But I'm just trying to write all the possibilities, okay? Okay. Yeah, let us start with Amir. Well, yeah, yeah, Amir. Give me a line. Line? A, A, D end. A what? D, B. Yes, D, B, it's a line. Very good. D, B, it's a line. And it's it's open on D. It's open on B because both ways are not arrows. Bravo. هلا حسن بدي يعطيني ري يا yeah. يلا يا حسن في عنا ري um, no we don't have a ray we don't have a ray very good يا حسن التاف we have التاف yes give me a segment A segment يا الطاف A بدي تكون ما في أرز على الميلتين A C A في أرو C في أرو بدي أنا segment 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 it's segment it's C D برافو يا الطاف Excellent. So CD, it's a segment because it's closed on both terms. So that was everything about lines, ray, and segment. Next time, I'm going to start by parallel, intersecting, and perpendicular. But please, please, please watch the video. Okay? Okay. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.
Bye. Bye. Bye.